Kentucky, everyone over here in the kitchen with Miss Alison Davis, and it looks like we're making something with some peaches. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You've been, did you rehearse that? No, I just really like peaches. Okay. <laughs> um, no, we're doing grilled peaches. So this is like a simple, fast, okay. beautiful summer dessert that doesn't get enough glory, I don't think. I'm sure it does. Right? Because who doesn't love a good peach? Well, I don't, know. I don't think I've ever had a grilled peach. Oh, they are so I've had fantastic stewed grilled. peaches um, I've and peach pie, yeah. peach cobbler. Which are all really loaded down with calories. Oh, they and are? And this is probably a less or more healthy right. option. Um, oh, please. So You've got it full of sugar. I did a little brown sugar on there, but that's going to help to caramelize it. So then we're just going to take the peaches right on our hot grill. Yeah and just let those sit and caramelize. We don't even have to flip them right now. We're gonna let those go. Now, I'm also toasting a little bit of pecans yeah. uh, because I love like the flavor combo, right? Yeah. But we need to add another layer and that's with this little topping of ricotta cheese. Ricotta? Yes. Okay. Or you could do mascarpone. Yeah, right? I'd do mascarpone. Yeah, because it's more yeah. of a dessert cheese yeah. sometimes. But yeah. we're going to sweeten up the ricotta and it will work. Because you've, right. had, you've had some Italian ricotta desserts, right? Yes, There's I have. Cakes yeah. Yeah, and yeah, 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 yeah. So we're going to take the lemon ricotta. Yep. Is that lemon right? flavored? No, ricotta by itself. Oh, sorry. I was going to say, what? <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know where you get. I don't know where you're getting your ricotta from, dear. <laughs> We're going to add lemon to it. So, um, taking a bit of the lemon zest in here. Just yeah. take your microplane grater and. Just you know, start. I really hate using that thing. Why? Not that I use it, but it just looks. You know, I'm really into watching the Food Channel. Uh huh. The Food Network, I should say, and the Chew. And the Chew. No, because I'm watching to see what they do to see if you're up to par. Oh. Wow. <laughs> and we all know that I am. <laughs> all right, so lemon juice. Those are caramelizing. You see how You know I get my words from there. Oh, good. So then when I come back to you, I sound efficient. Yeah. And know what Look I'm saying. That. And you'll char grilled oh. your peaches. Char grilled my peaches. Char grilled. I did. A char grilled, okay. Um, so we added a little Is that the lemon. Right word? <laughs> it was perfect. <laughs> it was perfect. We can go ahead and turn that grill oh. off. I added a little lemon zest, a little lemon juice, and we're going to add a little touch of honey in here to our ricotta. We're going to mix this up, and then this just becomes kind of a little. Oh. Did you do it? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, so we're going to mix this up, and we are going to top this on our peaches. Yeah. So it's going to kind of melt a little bit over Are you going to crush it. them? And then we'll sprinkle the pecans right on top. You but could chop them if you yeah, want. Yeah, I would mm -hmm. crush them. Just for it to be a little bit easier yeah. to bite into, right? That's it? That is it, my friend. So we talk about a quick, simple, southern, uh, delicious dessert that is still quite healthy because the bulk of it is just the fruit itself. Oh, yes. You've got a little bit of the nuts. We didn't add any any oil, any yep. sugar, anything. We just toasted the Well, I just want to taste that themselves. ricotta. With, did you put lemon in it? I did a little lemon oh, zest, it actually a little smells lemon like. juice, and just a touch of honey. Mm. I yeah. didn't see you put the honey yeah. in there. Um, I got a little raw honey, and mm. I just added just a touch of that so that it's more of a sweeter dessert cheese. Yeah, that's nice, actually. All right, so we're going to plate this up. And, yeah, happy uh, I've approved. I am, I am. I'm going to chop these pecans. Yeah, I'd crush them up a little bit, my friend. Yeah. Just so they're a little bit more sprinkled. and Agreed. I think they look a bit more classy. Don't you think? Hey, if you want to find out this recipe. You, <laughs> if you want to find out how you can do this recipe and many more, head over to wtvq.com forward slash Midday Kentucky. Or also, head over to wildtimecooking.com. Alison has an incredible website with lots of cooking schools up there, everyone. If you want to send off not just your kids, but also adult cooking classes as well. And I keep promising I will come over. But I sort of, I don't really want to sit there with everyone and, and pretend I know what I'm doing. Alison, okay. you're not listening to me. Well, maybe we'll have a private lesson. Yeah, but like, does everyone know how to cook in these classes? No, no. Oh. Any, any... So it's for... Mm -hmm. Well, Any do you think I'm a level. beginner? I don't. Oh, okay. Medium? Maybe you're a, Intermediate. you're a foodie. How about that? Oh, I know what I like. Yes. You know what I like. We'll be back <laughs> right after this short commercial break.